afraid. I am not afraid. I hold my hands up. Err. Err. Sometimes the run is run. The run, run burns out. The run runs out. You can lose six months. You are out. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Hi everyone and welcome back to another episode of the BTS podcast. You are joined by your lovely host Beatrice, Tammy and Sharon and welcome back to the BTS podcast. Woo! Another week, another episode. Period. As always, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, make sure you like and also follow us on our socials. That's BTS pod underscore on Instagram and on Twitter and on TikTok as well. I always forget about TikTok but... We're on TikTok, so make sure you guys follow us up on all our platforms to stay up to date with all our content. Um, but anywho, what was I going to say? Oh, I was going to say, um, obviously, I feel like everyone knows um, this past like week and a bit from when you guys obviously watched this. Um, a lot of people have been like talking about um, this influencer um, who basically like uploaded a TikTok, and she basically was like, I think the heating in her place had like basically broken down, and she basically was like, I'll call like. I'm off to the Savoy, like, uh, you know, I can't, I can't deal with this cold weather and stuff. And obviously, like, people, you know, we're very aware that they're the rich, they're the working, you know, the working class, and then they're people who are sovereign. And that's just the way, like, the society's set up. But, um, yeah, it was just very, very interesting to see, like, how the reactions were to that, which obviously I think is standard. Like, you would expect that if you're somebody that's uploading that video, you're going to expect comments to be like, Oh, she like you're a bit toned. No, you're gonna be toned deaf. Like that's. TikTok. I don't think she. I don't think I... she would. I don't think she thought that. I think she just thought it was just an innocent video of. She was just thinking, Are like people that naive. So but also, the but I, I, but I think you're... that everybody says things about people that are like in this day and age. A lot of people are very sensitive. Like. You could literally... Which is why I'm saying that wouldn't you just expect it because you know people are just gonna are people are just so sensitive nowadays. Even though you know you're you're not gonna be bothered about it, you don't care, but you know that that's gonna be that's gonna be the reaction. Well, it's kind of like I, I, I don't know, I just feel like if your circle is all rich, to them the Savoy might not be that expensive. But it might be like us being like, Oh, it's too cold in the UK, I'm going to Dubai and then you book a flight to Dubai the next week. Yeah. That's stuff. That's something that we've both done. We, yeah. we wouldn't necessarily think that people are going to be like, oh my. No, God, but I know that if, I, if I'm going on TikTok, if I'm uploading something on a tick, a platform like TikTok, and I put somewhere like, oh, um, especially during times like this, like I'm not talking, about, and especially like you know, for example, during the no, COVID, I do. For example, during the COVID time, like I wouldn't be telling people outright, like who I know have maybe like, do you know what I mean? On, on a platform like that, I wouldn't be saying, oh, like I'm out, see ya, deuces, like. It would be, I so would be for, respectful. At, at what, at what time? So basically, when we went to the, when we went to Dubai, it was like the heat of COVID. Obviously, pe people were like, starting to like fall ill. Family members were starting to go into hospital and stuff. And obviously, we went to Dubai. And I don't think it was, it was, it was, it was that. Dubai a year after COVID. <laughs> no, but say. obviously, no, I know, I know, I know. But it was still like, yeah, like it, was it was still, still rampant. rampant. It was still rampant. No, but I don't think. And people were looking down on people. No, it wasn't. It no, wasn't people, promoted people to travel. Weren't, no, no, no. People weren't looking down on people that were going to Dubai because Dubai was telling people to come. And come no, to I know. But, but I think what it was. like you're endangering people. But I know that. You're not endangering people if you're getting tested. The one that I was saying that people were incentive to if they've mm. told us it's different if you're allowed to go to it's not like you you, you yeah, yeah, you're, yeah you're now yeah. sneaking into yeah, dubai you've gone through yeah, turkey you've yeah, gone to another place oh, but obviously to get the, the actual guy i feel like the guidance at the time was don't travel if it's not needed but we said it's needed for our mental health and that's what i'm trying to say that's what i'm trying to say like but the thing no, is but no, 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 i know no, i know no, that but no, no, it changed no, while you were on holiday no 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 it didn't change while we were on holiday before we know we know what we did we know what we did tammy no i'm telling you it was not it what the guidance was do not tr like only travel for like basically like nest like necessary stuff no, and there was two levels of the travel there was there was basically where like, travel was like a no but then there was also like we had to show like actual evidence oh, so they're, they're, they're we had to show actual evidence of like you're going for so a what funeral was, or what was you going? Yeah, no, 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 we didn't but when we went we didn't need evidence but the guidance That's what i'm saying but the guidance was still 
only travel if it's necessary to admit. It was. No, trust me. It, I don't think it, it was. I'm actually trying to remember. No, it wasn't. I I got, like, because when my was, parents went to Nigeria because um, of my grandma's funeral, yeah, that was in um, that was yeah. no, that was uh, when did it? That was in January. Yeah. And that was January. After, I know, after, the, after we had just gone to lockdown. That, that, that was tier four. four. We understand that. We went that. before tier four. That's yeah. what I'm saying. What I know I'm that it changed. That I know that people were still travelling because people still... Yeah. People still were flying, yeah. depending on which country you were going yeah. to. To be honest, but, but and do I you don't think, think the guide... Well, the guide, I the guide, definitely uh, know that the guidance for... I'm not sure if it was necessarily when we were going to Dubai, but when we went to Marbella, the guidance for that, because I remember when I was oh, yeah. telling people, I was like, I'm not really trying to tell my colleagues that yeah, that. Yeah, because yeah, the that guidance for sure. that was for definitely, like, do not travel. Like, it's period. like, don't travel unless it's necessary. Yeah, but I'm telling you, for Dubai, it was <clears> actually still that case, because also, it was the point where they were I like... Thought, yeah, I thought so many people were going no, to Dubai. No, so many people were going, but we went. Remember. But basically, the point that we went... And then they closed Dubai. They closed the borders of Dubai, yeah. and everybody oh, closed yeah, it. Yeah. But that was my point. Dubai no, was telling people no they definitely the were but people we didn't go no, you know there was a point where like loads of people were going to the back we didn't go there but we was, went when no no, no we went go? like december. literally yeah literally just before beginning of december just before the oh, tier four okay. stuff had kicked in no 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 but my point was there was a time yeah between, oh yeah yeah between, it, no do you know what it was it was september yes that, that they was, said and no, that's no, when no. we started to entertain the idea that like, oh, we need to make sure everyone's going to buy we need to buy we said we're going it to was christmas. september that People were going to Dubai. Yeah. But I think that was when they were like, oh, um, we advise you not to travel. But I think when it was your time, yeah. I think they kind of like, it wasn't, it, people were still, people were but able we, to travel. But when we went to, when we went into tier four, I'm pretty sure that it was still kind of rampant. And also, I think what was interesting because was that, it's because it started getting colder. And, and, and not, so, yeah, it started and getting colder. That's so what they said as well. Like, they were like, look, we're getting into winter now, it's going to be more rampant and stuff like in terms of if you want if you want to be able to spend Christmas to not be in lockdown, behave accordingly because you know they were saying like, you know, you know, if if it continues to be in that trajectory, I then think basically it was like that people being locked down. Advising yeah, and also versus, versus yeah. saying yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. But anyway, regardless though, um I know that I can joke about it with you guys, I can joke about it with my friends, but platforms where it's been pushed out and especially if you've got followers already if i've got a big followers and stuff i'm i can post i'm not saying i wouldn't post it mm. but i would know that there's going to be some trolls you know even like the luxury lux, even a luxury lifestyle base there's always going to be some I trolls actually, I, I, I think that's when i watched it i was like i don't really see the issue but I, again i put that on my yeah. private story because you know mm. like some people mm. be like yeah i don't have time for that um but then actually vanessa messaged me and she was like the issue is that she's made it seem like Oh my gosh, the heating is done here. So I've just gone online and I've booked a night in the subway. No, they asked her to come and they paid her. Yeah. Yeah. And like, that's the thing. It's like you're yeah. making it seem like, you know, people are actually suffering. They're yeah. choosing between like gas and electricity and like food on the yeah. table. I saw an article recently where it's like mothers are having to like reuse dirty nappies yeah. because they don't have enough money to like yeah. buy fresh. Yeah. And you're here like, <clears throat> Instead of calling the, I'm sure to fix the heat and it's probably cheaper than yeah, that would make the money that you're spending the summer. Especially with the way they were summer. I'm wearing years. 80 denier tights and curls. That like, is okay. No, no that's yeah. why I said that. Like, when I first watched it, I was Gosh. like, oh. I was yeah, like, I kind of was, I was like, like, oh, okay, here we go again. Just, like people are just. She's letting us know. That. And no, and no, I, no, no, I was yeah. even thinking. Like, I was even. I was doing uh, to the comments. I was like, oh, I don't really see what. Just mm. let people do. What, for no. me, yeah. For me, yeah. When I see things like that, and I see loads of people commenting like, "Oh, you're so," I'm just like, "Draw, draw." No, absolutely. Yeah, no, I'm just like, what they want to do. Are we gonna keep having this conversation about how some people are tone deaf? Like we've yeah. been. Like saying, I'm just yeah. like, let people do it. But then I think it was the fact that she now said, it's "I'm her, going to the Savoy." Yeah. yeah. But then, well, like, like, you maybe it's but then I'm going to the hotel. But then all. So what the issue was as well was her response to people posting it. Oh, really? oh I didn't go that far. Oh, 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 you didn't see. No, I only saw so the she was funny. Like, but it, well, I'm sorry that you are going through that. But even not even I'm sorry, but it's basically just like, well, but that's not my reality. That's basically what yeah. that, was, that was. Those were kind of what she was saying. I, I don't have my phones up, so I can't it but basically, she was making it clear that that's a you that's problem. a you problem, and that ain't that's a me problem. That's affecting me. That's literally what she was responding. And the thing is, like, and you know what? And the reason why, I'm just, no, no. And the reason why I'm just like, also, I want to be a well, I want to be with Kenny. No, but listen, I think the reason why as well, I was being like, oh, come on, is that is the fact that she even took the time to even respond to loads of comments. I'm just like, why you yourself know that? Okay, I'm just posting this for content. I'm posting like you know how. 
you know you, yeah, you post like, stuff you just let people you just let people post and let it go let, like yeah. you're going to stop actually replying saying well that's what you you're like, making it even worse and you're making yeah, I think, yeah, it's, it's, definitely, to, it's but, definitely tone deaf i yeah. feel like she but should do you have think done it was intentionally tone deaf because i don't think it was intentionally tone deaf but i think you know, I think it might have been, you know. No, I don't think it was intentionally shot because, but I think that hmm. she could have styled the content in another type of way. Not that, oh, my heating is broken. That's the reason I'm because going to the same boy. Her, like, so is her heater actually okay, broken? I have, yeah, but I have actually seen her content. I've seen her content before. Like, I yeah. don't follow her, but I've seen it. It's come up on my For You page. Yeah. And, stuff. and Vanessa was saying that she's actually been following her since, like, was, did Vanessa say since school? Really? Okay. Yeah, for a long time. She does high end luxury. Um, exactly. Like, that I is, I know, that but, is her but, but my point is, but I she understand. didn't need to start it like, but I understand. I'm so I'm saying, cold. My heating is broken. My heating is broken. That's my point. I'm saying, the type of content that she okay, last la savoy go bear. But why is she using the example of my heating is broken? That's why I'm going to do yeah. it. Why can't unless, you just be like? Wait, 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 but unless, do you think? Do you actually think that her heating is broken? Okay. Okay. broken. Okay. If the heating's not broken, then you're just. You're that's what I'm saying. Really and even if the heating, <laughs> even if the heating was broken, I don't think the savoy would have said, "Okay, because of your for heating, this yeah. moment." I don't think they would say, "Okay." Because your, your heating, heating is broken, broken. Exactly. we, we should, are going to book it. I don't think how do they even know that heating's broken? Yeah, yeah come on. Why true. couldn't she just do a generic? Oh, do you know what it is? What, a day in London, I'm staying at the Savoy. Do you know what I mean? Why, yeah, why yeah, couldn't she do that? People need the views, bro. People yeah. need the views. But maybe maybe it was are like, you saying, are you saying that people her. plot and twist? Yes. Plot and scheme. People make no, stuff, make it rhyme, make, make it look, nah, make it look funny. I was just gonna say maybe it was gifted and it was like use it within certain time of the year, and she was just like, ah, well, now that my heat is broken, we're gonna use their hot. Yeah, and, and that could definitely be the that yeah, could definitely but that's be the case. People, but even so, but that's not. And how do I explain it? That's not she people's to quit- reality unless there's something severely wrong with your home. Like, let's say that your heating is broken, yeah? yeah. My dad's not going to be like, come on, everybody, let's, let's go. No, 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 let's go no, to no, the no, hotel. No, 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 no. <laughs> if you were already <laughs> gifted, if you were already gifted, but hotel, that's, no, 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 that's, you right. might say this is now an opportunity for us to quickly go and use the, but they're fixing the heater. In this winter, this winter, let's just quickly go and stay there. That's fine, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I'm just talking about myself. I personally wouldn't come on my, Thing and say, oh, because and my heater is, is broken. And this and is the issue. I would have been like, Even might be I would have been like, oh, I just want to treat myself. I'm yeah. going to stay at the luxury yeah. hotel, the Savoy, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. That's how I would have done it. I don't even even me, I can even say, I can even say, and I'd be like, look, oh, my heat is broken, but obviously I was so fortunate enough to be gifted this. Um, yeah, to be gifted like that. Like, I was so fortunate. So, 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 you so, 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 People that I know, like influencers and stuff who are high end, because obviously, like, you know that, yes, the majority of your people that are going to be doing this content to are going to be people that can afford that sort of stuff, right? People also just want to be able to tap into lifestyles just yeah, to see yeah, what yeah. their ambitions can be and stuff. So, you know, you're going to get a vast range of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we know that, again, we know what, we know when you're working. So, like, say something is being gifted is not like a bad thing. And actually, no, it's, yeah. you're meant to by law to stay when yeah, something's but, being yeah, gifted. Yeah, yeah, but I don't think, like, when you get to that level, you're going to be doing, I was so fortunate. No, but even, no, no. For every No, gift but that for, you gift, get. for gifted well, stuff, you might be paid like, to do it as well. Like, a lot of these influencers will always say, well, Vanessa, let me just First of all, Vanessa said gifted. First of all, it's not even gifting. You're being paid to do a service. Yeah. No longer gift. Gifting is when you get something for free. Yeah, and, 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 you, know, and you can say, and, and the subway, and the subway have invited me down. Like, is it like, you know what? I think the subway have invited me down, and my heater's broken. So let's just go. This perfect time. While they fix my heater, while they it's fix my heater, let's go. About the thing. There's I so many ways. I okay, feel sorry. Like, I might have said it wrong. Let me read what Vanessa said. She had a sponsored trip to the subway, and she should have just said so. The preamble about hot water and the lack of heating was unnecessarily pretentious and super tone deaf in my opinion especially when she's being paid to go yeah which is which true but my with. but my thing is that there's certain we spoke about this in the last Sorry, one it was not gifted or sponsored yeah. mm. Different. um we spoke about this in an episode where we was talking about um colorism and things like that there's certain words that you have to be careful that you use yeah. or there's certain words that you should use instead of another word and yeah. that makes a whole lot. even though they're just words it yeah. makes a whole situation and for different. somebody who's been let's just say vanessa's been following she's her she's, years. Been she's not school. she's not any small baby she's, she's not a small baby just like she's she yeah, no, no, no. yeah 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 Do you know what i mean but i think like, and then in this dire time like 
I don't know if you've been seeing on your for, for you page, yeah, like mothers like saying that, like crying on TikTok, saying that they they don't know what to do. Yeah. They have to choose whether to turn on the heating or or use gas for the cooker. Yeah. Like, but no, those literally, are, those are everyone, and I'm just saying, like, even if she was just like, oh, I was so, I was so fortunate. Yeah, she, she, I'm so, like, using words like, oh, I'm so grateful for this. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm so, I don't she, even know if she's tone deaf. I think she's just, I. I felt that she was just intentionally trying to just be That's like, what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, I this is like, this is my That's what I'm saying. I, thought, Do you know I, what I, mean? I don't believe that she intentionally said, intentionally. Yeah, I don't think she was intentionally being tone deaf. I yeah, don't know I that's, do. a thing. that's what I'm trying to say. Oh, you're saying that she was intentionally yes, being tone deaf? Because in my opinion, I'm just like, I get that cost of living, like, I get that she's rich and stuff, but cost of living will impact everybody. Yeah. Like, no matter where you are in the, like, hierarchy or yeah. whatever of money, mm-hmm. like, the price of things are going to go up. Mm-hmm. The impact it will have on you will be, like, less mm-hmm. if you're rich, but yeah. if you're poor, obviously, it's, like, a greater impact. Yeah. So there's no way that you can be just even... Like, I'm not, like, somebody who watches the news a lot mm. or, like, that kind of... But I still know what's going on. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So, like, you can't tell me that. I'm you so live sorry. in yeah. London. Yeah. Yeah, you live in... Even just... And living, just, even I, mean, I work in Mayfair, yeah? I still see people on, like... You know, like after a certain time, like they'll be sleeping, yeah. like in the like in the you corner know, box. Yeah, yes. like people will say in our channel, like, "Oh, guys, be careful!" Like when you open the door, because there's actually a homeless person sleeping there. Like you don't want to like hit them when you open the door, fam. In West London, like yeah. there's no way that you're living in London where you're not gonna know that cost of living yeah, is impacting people. For me, so how my, can you say now because of the, your heating is broken or whether I'm it's just broken saying, or not? I feel know. like she posted it not knowing the impact of the words that she was saying. Absolutely. So that's why I'm saying that no, I don't I think, think yeah. she was intentional yeah. in the sense that she she was trying was, she was to, trying to be insensitive. Yeah. Okay. I just feel like she did something. She, she, she didn't she, she 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 didn't think things through in order like maybe she didn't I don't know whether but she just, watched it. I don't know whether she thought that the words and stuff that she used would have a But don't you think if somebody if somebody said something and they didn't realise the impact it was gonna have have not that been, you would not the, be the aftermath of that would you not know, be the comments that she has now been yeah made. that's my point i still don't think she i don't think she gets it or that she just definitely that's, that's what i'm saying but I, and 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 some people like we've said before i keep on referring back to the other mm-hmm. episode but some people don't know things so bad that it's just installed in them like they don't know that they're doing it you don't know that you're using certain words to describe certain things mm-hmm. because yeah. of how you've been conditioned you don't know how you treat people a certain way because of how you've been conditioned that's just not that's just no, what you feel Cassie, is i natural. get what you're saying but let's be real if some if you're saying you're going to the cyber and someone in the comments is saying um that's great for you but for a lot of us out there someone yeah. and, and people in the comments actually some, some, of them, the some of them are actually edu- some of the comments that she was responding to people actually educated not even just talking about themselves i understand your person at the time can no, you know no, no, the thing is i understand but how many times have we seen influencers yeah do this stuff when people are saying, oh, no, this isn't right, they'll, they'll be telling you, oh, get your money up, or do, do you understand? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. Like, that. That. We don't see that. We don't see that's wrong. I understand that we're saying that it's wrong, but I'm saying that this isn't something that but is she just... Also, but, she's also, but she's also a veteran. Like, this is not somebody who's new to she's the game. Not, well, she's not a veteran to me, fam. I don't even know. I didn't I, know I, the babe. I, I, I just saw her with one long dress and tights. Like, I don't really know who the babe is. Was it a dress? It was a dress and tights. I don't know why I thought it was a dressing gown. Anyway. <laughs> no, she started in the dressing room. Oh, okay, then, then she, she went But, but my oh. point is, is that sometimes these, as much as, I think we forget that some of these influencers, even though they're so big and stuff like that, they're actually just normal. They're, very they're just very they're like, they're just children. Some, some of them are children and, and some of them are just normal people that you... Like, I'm that, so sorry. You can't be that shielded. Like, even me, I know the things I'm shielded from. Do you know what I mean? Like, I know I can't talk on, like, the situation that's happening with, um, like, the Muslim girl in, yeah. is it Pakistan? Yeah. Like, I can't speak on that because I don't know exactly all but the details. Michael, but at least I know I'm shielded from. Do you know what I mean? Like, no, I know. That's you know? why, that's why there's just some certain things that I don't, I don't speak on. That's why. Because I, I don't know, I don't know niche. <laughs> I don't know nothing about that. I'm not afraid to say that. You're not afraid to say that. Like, I'm not afraid. Exactly. I'm not afraid. I'll hold my hands up. <laughs> I'll hold my hands up and say there's certain things that I'm not even gonna touch because boy, that is not that that's it's not my business, yeah. but it's one of them ones. It's like I don't even want to say anything wrong yeah. that can put me in a jeopardizing position. Yeah, and before they start, we? before they start, before they start contacting my employer, Tammy, and I'm getting fired, Tammy, and then I don't have. I'm, I'm crying. <laughs> Tell me, think about that, yeah, and then just think about, and who are we? You, that you even have, like, how many thousands of... Your, 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 your income, your income, 
your income is even based on people, people following you. And people. But, but, but I need to, I need to, I need to, I need to, I need to make you on um, people understand that some people are just stupid. No, I know. Some people don't think about stuff like that. That's true. Stuff, stuff like that don't. Uh, that some people don't think they're immune. That's why. That's yeah, that's, extreme. That's, I've that's, now, I've that's why there's always these take downs. She's not learned, fam. She's still battling people on TikTok. <laughs> that's why now. <laughs> Probably. That's why. That's why. Sitting in the sun with me. Well, it doesn't impact me. Literally. Your heat has been fixed now. Go back. That's why we always have these. No one is above all of these things, but. It's just sad it's that above it's just kids. like these influences. It's like how do I explain it? It's not like they're trained. Mm. I don't know how. Like you know when you have a job, mm. in order for you to get higher in levels, you get trained. Mm. These influencers have to do is buy better clothes, mm. <laughs> buy, buy more expensive this. Oh, oh, do you know? I understand like there's even though I'm not saying that influencers are the most easiest job it's in this not. world, but <laughs> literally it seems like any like you can just be an influencer <laughs> just by doing things that are not i don't know what the, i don't know how to phrase it but it's like these people are just common people like they didn't train they didn't go for like oh influencer influencer class they didn't they didn't go for all of these things like celebrities it's, very, it's a very natural it's, it's a very like you, you just you, based you, on your influences and then you society, you pick up things based on the things that you've experienced it's not like someone has written like a guidebook of yeah. oh this is how you're meant to be an influencer you're not meant yeah. to touch on this point you're not meant to do that like yeah. They don't have all of these things in... Like, if you were to compare a celebrity with an influencer, celebrities, most of them have, like, big teams. They have a they have a, 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 a team dedicated to PR. Yeah. These influencers have... One, most of them have one manager that's putting on the hats of, of, of everyone. Yeah. Manager, stylist. <laughs> like the Hoover. <laughs> like the five in one <laughs> Managers are the hands. And they're doing that for about five people. Yeah, exactly. Sorry. So what I'm saying is that there's not a lot of But that's also why, you know, we know that content creating is such a new career mm. that people will make mistakes and also you yeah. that are in it, people are know like, okay, you know what? This hasn't been done before. Whoops, I've learned. And you learn from other people's mistakes. You know, there's no way that babe does not know somebody that's part of her own crew that's also an influencer that has not been hit with backlash yeah. about something that they yeah. posted you yeah. love other people's yeah. mistakes and that's the yeah. whole thing about influence it's a yeah. whole new adventure so well, she didn't think like, that's why she's still battling people on Twitter. that's what uh, I'm saying some people just no, I think, I think, she's just I think generally some sake. people genuinely don't see and no, but some things people that are, some people don't see when they're wrong mm. until do you know what it is her thing is might just be like I'm just telling my truth like, yeah it's it's like, she, like, she, you know how we said about how but um, that's Harry, what no how we said about what's his name um I always say his name. Um, Harry Panero. No, Harry Panero. Hardy, Hardy, Hardy Caprio. When we talk about uh, when he was like Monday, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Like, that was his. He's just like yeah, that's I'm just telling you what reality, happened, like, but with a bit more fl- a bit of flair. flair. Exactly. But and I think that's what I'm trying to say is that like she and this is exactly what Vanessa was saying. I don't mean to like drag Vanessa mm. into this topic or whatever, but she was just like yeah like that's fine but like she should she could have just mentioned it's a sponsored trip this is what i'm trying to say like, and, and that's, that's, a, and that's, a, and that's, that's a nuance new one. that changes the context of the entire post. but this is also why the legislation came out is because people and influencers and, and stuff were were basically <coughs> portraying stuff mm. and without As making people organic, aware yeah, and, yeah, and yeah, and also yeah without yeah. making people aware that actually even though i'm promoting this product they're paying. You have to state when you're getting yeah, something. You're, they're paying even a sponsorship, even a gifted. Yeah, there's yeah, so yeah, many different tags gifted. that you have yeah, to yeah, gift. Yeah. You have to not gift. Certain things you have to basically disclaim. Yeah. Which is why I'm like, this is the reason why they do it for certain things where it's like, I don't even know how to explain it. You don't want people to be under for selling something or providing a service or promoting something under false pretense. It's wrong. Like, yeah. and, and in this context, she's making it seem like as if she's just used her own money. In the situation yeah, where she's got her heating to go to the like. subway, you guys should, and she's promoting like that's you why guys. Basically, it's basically like a promotion, and like, you guys go and do it too. When actually, <laughs> people should not be using their money when, <laughs> their, when their heater is broken Listen. to go to the subway. She's doing it because she's yeah, got a gift. Okay, this is yeah. why people with sense. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. And if she, and I think. I'm making this conclusion on her behalf, but I think I'm right. I can't lie. She can comment here if she disagrees. <laughs> because you're probably fine with her. But listen, babe, I'm not going to lie. If they didn't give you sponsored things, you ain't going to no Savoy. Yeah, literally. literally. You're not spending no, your money. Exactly. You would fix the heating yeah. and you go and sleep in another literally, hotel. You, 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 or you, you go and buy the, 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 the portable. <laughs> no, but even someone who's very wealthy. Are you the first? Even someone who's very, very 
pray well for you. You'd even just go and find an emergency person who can fix it on the day and pay the most extreme yeah. prices for it. But you're not buying you it yourself, yourself to hop in that car. Bro, somebody who's got money is no, not no, make, no, it's no, not no, moving no, themselves. No, they, no, themselves. No, they make people move around them to fix them. So don't try that, honey. We see right through you. We see right through you. Like I said, you can comment below if you're wrong. But I think I'm right. That's what I'm saying. You're not. Ain't convict bro. Bro, is bro. That's a big thing. Bro. No hot water. No tea. No nothing. <laughs> and you know, you're trying to tell me that. Okay, let me instead of fixing it here, let me pack my bag and, and go, go to the hotel. hotel. Yeah, out the here, hotel's man. probably fine. That's what I'm trying to say. You have to pay for it. She's probably passed about fifteen hotels on the <laughs> <Yeah. way. laughs> You know what I mean? Like, oh yeah, let me go to the subway. That's what hotels. Even if you need a hotel, why? Literally, there's so many nice nice hotels. I think subway's not even that nice. But anyway, that's not the point. The point is that. Yeah, exactly. That's the thing. Um, but yeah, I just think that you know with that situation i just found it very very crazy the fact that she was just so like adamant with her responses i was just like now this this baby's actually up her yeah keep on going be wrong and strong <laughs> strong and wrong <laughs> no people who are strong and wrong are funny boy so that's what that's me strong and strong i love a wrong and strong moment yeah that's what i'm saying sometimes i, I like it you know when you're having a fight this to the end you know when you're like i've said it now I like, I like, you know that moment where you're like, oh crap. Yeah, 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 you're like, you're right. No, but I, I, no, but my pleasure is watching someone be wrong and strong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And just watching them be wrong and strong. Me, I'll be looking here. And the thing is, yeah, have you ever had it as well where they're wrong and strong yet? And you actually bring the evidence to show that you are correct. And they still want to keep going. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I can't even like that. That's the way you said it. That's the way you said it. That's the way you said it. I didn't mean it like yeah. that. Like obviously I was joking. Yeah, but it's the way you said I can't it. Like, I, I definitely do find myself sometimes in that situation. But I think it's more just like it's, it's it's slightly a banter thing. But it's like you know when you're so in something that you didn't know, but then <laughs> no, not no, shame. No, 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 other things like the way they're even looking at you like no but actually because you're oh, giving me a now you're even annoyed about something else yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Like, this, this, is, this is the this is the thing but you're going like this yeah <laughs> <laughs> trying to get it with, in a different angle but you're going yeah like, exactly hey wrong and strong literally. that is so funny nah but yeah you actually just have to to get out of that one the both of you just gotta start laughing yeah <laughs> that's literally it <laughs> that's literally that's it. actually the only way to, to um, exit that situation but yeah anyway that Sha- name yeah what's her name I don't know. Yeah, I don't even know. This is Walsha. Anyway, we'll, we'll check we'll, in next we'll week. We'll put her thing in the, the box. <laughs> or the title. Yeah, the, the title. Wait, I'm please. crying. Song of the week. So as you guys know, each week we do a song of the week. And my song of the week this week is coming from Wizkid's latest album. What's it called? I have not um, listened to it. Wow. Oh. Not a single song. I'm uh, listening to like no, someone has played it in the car, but that's my not okay. like I've gone out of my way to click the album. Cool. Well, I money and love. Called, but money and love. Is it? <laughs> I think that's just the name just of one know, song. I just I know the, say that it's the single that dropped. I just know the. Anyway, Sha, while Beatrice finds the um, name of the album, my song of the week is Wow, which in my opinion is. That's the name of the song. More love, less more love, ego. less ego. More love, less ego. I actually ego. did not know that. That's I just know that people say M L L E, but I didn't actually. I've never seen people do that. I ain't seen people do that either. Yeah. Um, but yeah, the song that I'm going to be picking for my song of the week is Wow featuring Skepta and Nana Marley. Okay, I've heard that song. Yeah, that's, that's, a, song. A, that's a good one. one. Yeah, like, yeah. I really, really like that one. Yeah. Um, Nara came in strong, yeah. uh, as he always does. Always does. Well, I mean, he had like this is ugh, this is why song of the week is always so long because we got to discuss these things. Mm. What happened to him? Because during 2019, 2019, it was, was 20... the year. It was 2019. It was the year you guys went to yeah, Georgia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He yeah, was yeah. on a roll. Crazy. And like, has he dropped an album since then? Yeah. Has he? Yeah. What, I didn't even know that. that. That's even crazy. Um, he literally just dropped an album a couple of months ago. Oh yeah, someone actually did say that. I have not. Listened someone to did it. say that. I haven't listened to it. Yeah, yeah, I might have known that, but I can't remember. His EP before did much better than I think did much. Well, I'm I haven't looked at the numbers or anything, mm. but I definitely think the EP before did a lot better than this that album now. now. But what's I going on like, with him though, personally? Do you guys know? I don't actually know, know what. Like, I just feel like. Family. But I don't. No, I don't see him. 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 I just feel like. I just feel like. There's when it comes to I feel like I've mentioned this before. 
when it comes to these Afrobeat it's artists, only the, it's only the top. No, no, no. It's not even about only the top. They Everybody no has their run. Yeah. Everybody mm. has their periods. Mm. Whether you keep it going, whether you don't. Yeah. Like at the moment, it's like okay, like yeah. that is the. Yeah. I don't but know. the thing is, though, Naira could have like I genuinely feel like he just. I don't want to use the word fell off because this is even another time I was having a conversation with my friend and I was like, what happened to Mayokun? Like, I don't understand. Like, he's just like not really putting out music the way he used to. He was like, he's actually writing a lot of like Dodo's music and songs and stuff. Like he writes a lot for some like artists and stuff. So I don't want to now be like they fell off because they might be actually doing something else behind the scenes. No, but I don't think, but I don't th- I just feel with like. With Nara, I just felt like he ha- he was he he was going strong it's not like he fell off because it's not like his music was then bad it was just like he just, he just no, i just feel like the hype i feel like there's just there, there's just a moment when there's always a hype for someone yeah like there was hype was 27 like that was that I know was that I, I get that that was that was his hype. at the moment like, burner boy is having his time where it's like this is his this is the time where he's having his hype like we've no like, i wouldn't say that burner no. no i wouldn't say that last last is his biggest no i know song. but i wouldn't say like it's oh like he high. yeah i just like, like he's, he's having his run he's like, he's yeah just, like, he's now run. becoming more and more known and he also he's always he's just always he's building on it and sound. he's adjusted the sound he's a Who, who's this? burner okay. okay and he just build and he just basically builds on you know how someone you yeah. can you basically you know, just growing yeah yeah. yeah. You know when someone actively makes an effort because they are an artist and they want people to effort them, mm-hmm. so they will put they will build, they will basically yeah. take on what the hype is been. And that's what I would say. I would say that about Burner. I would say that about Dojo. I would say that about Whiskey. Even though I don't personally like really, I prefer yeah. like the old Whiskey. But I still say that about Whiskey. Those are artists who are like consistently putting out music, consistently working hard. I'm talking about oh, the artists where I'm like, you were doing it, doing it, and then no, all of a sudden it's like... The, that's the point, hello, I'm, trying, that's the point I'm trying to make. They're still doing it. I just told you that he put out an album. Yeah, I know, but... I just told you that he put out an album. We are now in 2022. Yeah, but I'm saying... Yeah, but he yeah. just... Put, well, yeah, but there, there wasn't... A, the, that's what I'm trying to tell you. There was not, like, a massive gap that you guys are thinking about. He was still consistently putting out music, but no, it's the run. Yes, he was. He wasn't. He wasn't dropping singles consistently like that. Where was he? The only time that you're saying that he was dropping singles consistently was when we were all at home, at COVID, watching the screen. Hmm. I'm telling you. Nah, I'm I'm telling you. Puta came out during the lockdown. I'm 100% sure it did. I feel like it came out in 2020. It came out in 2019. What? Puta? Yeah. From the from my thought is twenty nineteen. Was was I'm, I'm looking, looking at Spotify was, right now by the but way. But is that is that what you call it? Is that the um September thirteenth, twenty nineteen. My thought twenty nineteen. But is this the is this part of is this the EP? Or was this the or, or was this the um This is a single. Oh well. well this is what they I'm don't tell me. But what I'm trying, trying to say, I'm not saying okay. Because to be fair, like looking at what he put out in twenty twenty, but what I'm saying is that he was still putting five, six songs in twenty twenty, and he's put out a few in twenty twenty one. But I don't know, maybe because he just was like putting out music a lot more often. But what I'm trying to tell you is, is, is the but run. even all this twenty twenty one stuff. We I ain't never heard of they're all fe- they're like features. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say is like the break that you guys are really talking about is not really like a ma- like. The most biggest break because he still came out with coming and that was a really big song mm. but what i'm trying to say is that some of these artists have a time where their hits back to back are but like are back to back hits mm. everyone has had that or everyone is is going to get that when i started listening to a shake in 2020 nobody was talking about the songs back then it's the every single time every <laughs> hit that he's, every single that he doesn't put out, music as out as often as he is but i'm saying I mean, that the reason why he's putting out smoke. no but the reason why he's putting out more music is because of People the run are, yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. exactly and but that's that. what i'm saying i get that but what i'm trying to say is that like these other people that i'm now talking about are not putting out music at, like, like who like Malcolm, for example. He dropped an album. I don't know what else you want people to do. He dropped an album. <laughs> no, no you know I'm saying the album. Are you talking about Malcolm now? Yes. The album that he dropped before then was when I was at uni in 2018. But he was dropping singles, right? Because he was still part of um. He was still part of um. D. Can you D. D. M. W. Or whatever mm. it's called. Or D. Whatever the video music world. Like, D. M. W. Then he left. A lot of his songs. A lot of his Malcolm songs have been features. That's. The- but that's the point. Well, I, can I ask a question? Go on. Do you think that 
things like concerts, things like tours, they also contribute to the longevity of like a song. So let's say for example now, Ashake put out his album. I personally, don't get me wrong, the album is fantastic, it's lit. Obviously in, in clubs, it still goes off. Like for example, if a Naira Mali song comes, comes on in a club, I'm still gonna vibe to it like yeah, as if it just came out. But obviously now Ashake, he's got his tour that he's going out everywhere. Yeah. We know that for example, Burner, maybe once a year or maybe once every other year, you're going to get a solid tour based on his album. You know, you're going to see Wizkid. Do you think that maybe with Naira, what might be the, and for example, someone like Melkin, what might be the, the difference with them is that they don't, you won't typically see them hold like a tour that takes them around no, that now no, that now no, them to no but he's not on but he's uh, is he on tour tour by right. himself not in the uk boy he's doing he's doing the u.s tour i'm telling you well, yeah 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 now but he hasn't been like is in like back I went, then yeah, yeah that was I when that was pre-covid that was 2019 what when was Mayoko's concert yeah that was 2019 that's what i'm trying to say but he's, he's only just now. now yeah but he's only just now that he's going on tour yes, because, because he's now left. he's leaving yeah but he's left I don't exactly think you guys which, is, which is why i'm trying to say that it's, it's difficult this is what i'm it's trying difficult. to say that people's the, the contracts that people are in the way the money that's funded behind them the way that they're able to promote and go on tours the people that are able to who have that ability to go on tours because even for ashaka to be the way Ashaka is even going on tour, I've never seen someone who's new go on tour like he has before. You wouldn't yeah. typically see somebody because like that unless you have the right that, contract, that's the right but, team. But, but that's my point. Exactly. The only reason why he's going on tour is because he's in the his, highlight yeah, of yeah, the yeah. run. Yeah, if he was not in the highlight of the run. he has the, the right run, team though to support He doesn't him. have any right team. No, because he does. They, no, he, he, has, he has somebody. Of course, of course, he's why, of course it's why we know that it's funded. He's yeah. trying to align with it. Yeah. There's a lot of money I don't know about my contract, okay, but for now, but someone like Naira Mali, mm-hmm. he's not signed to anyone. He's his own. He has his own label. So, okay, so he has yes. to fund. His, so he's not. He's not got a. Actually, that like, he has to fund his own thing. Is that yeah, what he's, you're he's, 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 he's Isn't that more dangerous? No, it's not. But I went to his. That might even. But I went to his show. What I was saying, like, is, that might, does, is anybody else? Had, and he had, and he did, and he went on tour. He went on tour in America. Just because they ain't coming here, don't no, mean they're not on tour. I know, but I'm just trying to say that I just, I, I just feel like. And I went his, in his show in 2019, just before COVID. Yeah, and like you do have to realize that COVID. Oh, absolutely. Had get that. Had a massive impact Abs- on absolutely. a lot of a lot of people. Like Davido had to cancel his tour. Yeah, in America, like, it had so just for people because they're. But not even on, that, that's even a that's even a, a loss that some people are gonna now have to suffer because they planned all of this and now exactly. they don't have the money to come in. Which is why I genuinely feel like money definitely has a part to do with it. Of One, course. two, his actual just lifestyle in general and who he is. I just think that someone that like one day call like I'm not being funny, but he he's no one can tell me he hasn't fallen off. Like the guy's like he doesn't put out music the way he he used to. Now when he's like when, now when you hear him sing, he's. A fe- he's featured on a song mm-hmm. like he's not putting out his own music like that his last album was 2015 i think it was like the year i started uni like do you know what i mean like and what my point about like david doe whiskey etc is like i can't like i get that david doe had his moment in 2017 but even pre-2017 like david doe was putting out like music that people but did what, enjoy yeah i know but and then he obviously saying- had his blow up moment but he's still consistently like that's fine but and also but, you, you also follow and also i can say something that is as well is about you you tend to like find like a, ni- a niche or like a character there's a, there's a point about your character that people resonate with beyond <coughs> just your music like yes. for example burner it's not just the fact that he's just got good quality music it's his person he's he's great like his his personality is just insane he's like as in like in terms of like do you know but do you know what i'm trying to say like people know him <laughs> <laughs> no, it is not no that's insane i don't mean someone like that i, mean, like, he's as I love burner boy he is not known for his person no his but personality is what put, puts him down but also people it it's like a status thing like for example like if someone it talks about big about themselves like you know that burner someone to call someone out on social you know that burner don't give a basically i would don't say give a, that he's very so for david o than burner no 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 but, but no but david o is more like a like it's like a liking like it's like if you like obo you have to you have it's more than just um but i don't think a lot like i kind of agree with Tommy. i don't think that these things like impact them 
their likability in, in the way that like I think you have to adapt if, if, someone doesn't post, if, if someone doesn't post on social media you don't allow people to understand the, if you're if not someone that flexes if you're not someone that posts on social media people aren't really going to be caring not going to be but following you with kids. no but no but whisk what I'm trying to say is I don't think it like in, I think it adds like, like, I think it adds it, longevity it, I think it, 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 it does wait hold on I'm telling, it doesn't you're telling me that based on David O if he didn't have so if we didn't have the way that he is in terms people of his whole community love, about people, people just people love, love David because know. he's so giving and we see that he's being given we see the people around him and the way they're that's that's his his personality, personality, but this is what I'm trying to say, say. No, what I'm trying to but say but that. he's adapting because if he didn't post it he's always been like that but if he didn't post it as but much as he does has always, no first of all Davido has always been posting no. ever since he came out but with this Daddy is what Europe, I'm trying to say he's no, always been no but what I'm trying to say is that social media for us plays a massive effect in terms of like the way that you have the way that you think about a celebrity right you don't just think about oh like them isolated in terms of their music you think about them as a person you think about them what they've done like for example i love summer walker right but when i think about summer walker it's not ju- i don't just think about her just in terms of she just released a song because oh it's this i know that when she's talking about this actually i know her ex that she's talking about i know because she's also shared that but i don't it, think it, but it, I don't it adds, think it adds, i don't think it i don't think it I adds think it to it because no, no, no sometimes it's even like sometimes it's, it's even negative it's even it's even negative, negative but negative but this is what i'm trying to say whether it's positive whether it's negative but it still adds your your on the Wait, forefront of people's just, minds and people know but, but that's the point I was trying to make in the other episode when I was saying that some of these celebrities they're just too easily accessible because now you're saying that they now have to be I'm not saying I'm not sure if this is what you're trying to say but from what I'm saying is that now you're saying that in order for them to be relevant they need to be posting on social media and staying relevant but who are we to even who are we to even say that that's what they have to be doing but their, their thing is to give but us the music their well, thing like, is to give us music and that is anything else is added bonus whether they snap whether they tell us where yeah. they are whether they're telling us oh a b and c that's all added bonus i don't really care about all the other stuff like obviously i like david because i like the way i like I, first of all, I like his music. Yes. Let's just start off with that. Yes, all the other stuff, all the oh, him posting on social media, him um, asking people to donate donate one million naira for his birthday. He's all insane. of that is all of that is added bonus. Yeah. What I'm trying to say is that I think the original point we were trying to say is that some of these artists are not being as consistent as they were. But my point is that it's not even about consistency. It's about it's about some people have a run and then that. it ends and, I and that's that. it. Someone like one day Cole, for me, I cannot say that, oh, he's fallen off. I don't think he's fallen off. I don't think he just doesn't have the financial support in that he used to have. He was signed to one of the biggest um, record labels in Nigeria at the time. He then moved on to Maven. It wasn't working out for him. Then he went on his own. He now has to fund everything through Black Diamond. That is not as easy if you're not having someone as back in the Jazzy. Say, though. So what I'm saying is that it's not as easy as saying that, oh, they need to put out music or they haven't been consistent. Sometimes it's actually, it's not as easy as it is. Why do you think loads of these artists okay, do Can I say something? Can I say something? Can I say something? Because it pays the call. bills. But that's what I'm trying to say, though. My whole can thing. Go on. They call. Just really quickly. Yeah. With him, yeah, though, he's been saying his album's coming out. Like, it's not me just being like, oh, he hasn't put out an album and, like, you've fallen off. It's like, uh-huh. he's been... And then what's happened that he hasn't put out the album? I did ask him. Did you ask him? No, but what I'm saying is that you, I, when artists say that, oh, they want to do music or they say that they want to do stuff, I never, I'm never like, oh, but they said that he's, like, I never come with that angle because I don't actually know what the heck is going on Absolutely. as to why he hasn't put out an Absolutely. album. That's why I said like, about Miracle as well. Do you know, remember, he even had, he even had a child. Nobody knew when that happened because he didn't post about it until maybe the child was two years old. Or oh, happy birthday to my child. Like, yeah. loads of things <laughs> come, <laughs> loads of things happen in between. Like, okay. you don't know, like, like I said, we had a whole pandemic. Yeah. Nobody was that. Like, I think in 2019 there were so many people that were touring. 2018, so yeah. many people that. That's where artists make their most money when they're on tour. But this is my point, which is what I was trying to mention. When you mentioned about Naira, I said that there's a lot of other factors that contribute to why someone stays relevant. I know you're saying music can just be it and that's it, but I genuinely feel like with him, I, I, I did say that. I think it's about the type, maybe the type of contrast is in who's funding it. You don't see him going on big, big tours constantly. Because if but I'm like, also, you don't understand, you don't understand maybe the, the hits that he might have suffered 
with this COVID. You don't even know legally what he's tied to and what he's not tied to, what he can say, what he can't say. There's just a lot of people I just behind think, the I scenes. Just, I just, you just don't know. I, I just feel like it, it, it just is what it is. Like, no, at the end of the day, we went, it is. at the end of the day, we went to, I went to the Naira Mali concert in 2020. Yeah. Just before, it was in February, just before the pandemic happened. When I said that, that was one of the most, the best, one of the best concerts, like, everybody, and, with, saying, everybody, everybody it's still, and it's still good. The, the, but that's what I'm saying, but no artist is, no artist is going to put themselves under unnecessary pressure just because of a tour. Like, I, if I know that I haven't, been consistently good than I was two years ago. There's no way, unless I'm a legend, unless I'm a legend where I know 100% that yeah, there's no, going to be agree. seats, there's going to be bums in those seats. I'm not going to do it. How many times has the band tried to do a show in the UK and how many people are buying the tickets? Yeah, no, 100%. P-Square, the one that they did in Royal Albert Hall, they didn't sell out. Yeah, I know. They're legends. That's what I'm trying to say. It's not. It, it's not about. I don't it, think we were talking about touring. Yeah, to be fair. No, but the, no, we, no, we, we were talking about runs. Mentioned. We were yeah. talking about. I was saying. I, what I was trying to say is that the only reason why. But if P Square, no offense, but if P Square didn't come back on this tour and didn't announce it, don't get me wrong. Yes, they did, and they obviously they released whatever they released and these songs and they released and stuff. Yeah. No one's gonna be chatting about them what do you mean as in like about peace even though they're legends no one's going to be talking about them like that that like i say like you hear their music what do you you're mean? always going to i don't understand so peace square obviously went on their tour yeah you know, since they've now come back right yeah so now see we're back we're here we're yeah. doing this and saying well next year we're going to come to london here we're going to do this blah blah, yeah. blah. Yeah. But what i'm just trying to say is that people understand that tours and those sort of things contribute to why you stay relevant because you can go on a tour based on an album that you released last year if it's still doing well to keep it going because for example even with this I don't, I don't absolutely oh, you absolutely agree can. with that you absolutely I don't, can I don't necessarily agree with that so what if you haven't talking, done it wait what, what what's the what point that you're agree? trying to make because what? isn't Bella's tour, tour going to be probably Love Damini yeah absolutely and this is what I'm trying to say in terms of like people because we're just talking about longevity, right? You said that Naira had a run. And I, I'm not disagreeing with you, by the way, but I'm saying that what the factors that contribute to it aren't just about like, just like, oh, they just didn't do this or they just didn't do that. But also it's about, in terms of music wise, but it's also mm -hmm. about the tours, about the ways that people do keep up with stuff, as in like, keep things keep on going. And yeah. the things that I was saying as well, and the reason why I mentioned social media is that I do genuinely feel like being in the social media, being in media present <coughs> constantly, whether it's even being recognised with this album or whether it's being um, something, something here or something, something there. If nobody here, if if Should Burner Boy, if Burner, Burner yeah, Boy's are huge, Burner Boy's yeah, a, yeah. no, but they're, this is, we're not talking about people like that though. But you're saying we're not talking about people like I'm that. I'm talking about people who know that I know that I'm not a legend. I've just, I've got a run. <laughs> I know I'm not a legend. I know I'm not a legend. No, but you know that you're not a legend. You were saying Someone that like nothing. Naira knew when he was blowing, Naira did not think that he was a legend. If he, he, I mean, his blowing stage did not think I'm bigger than Wizkid. No. He in his no, blowing of stage course did not, not think I'm, I'm bigger than Burner. But the original but you point know I was trying comparing. to, no, but the original point I was trying to make is that Sometimes these artists just have a run and that's it. No, I like, there's no, there's no amount like, of that can. like the, yeah, they have. There's exactly. no amount of Instagram. But, like, but with someone like no, but with someone like yes, yeah, exactly. Social. But with someone like Zlatan, you can understand that he's you can you know when you look at me come back. No, here. but you know when you look at somebody and you're like. It's clear that the you we just aren't relating with your music no more. Yeah, but with but somebody, no, I know, I know, I know, I know. That's the point I'm trying to I make. Know that sometimes they run, run, sometimes the run is the run, 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 run out. You can also six months you are out. No, no, when no. there's no tour, there's no there's no, no yeah. social media, there's no Instagram no, live, there's no Facebook no. live, there's no, no clubhouse, okay, there's okay, no okay. there's I know, no TikTok, I know, there's no TikTok dance that's to gonna save your career. No, 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 that, I know. There's, sometimes well, that people, is it. Yeah, but I know. But let's be real. <laughs> if you are somebody right, where you want, this is what you want. Mm. As in, like, it's actually your ambition. This is what you want. Wait, uh, wait, what wait, wait, want wait. Is not what we get. Yes, but you would see the failed attempts. Like, for example, you just said. With the band, you see that someone's tried to do something and it's failed. Therefore, you and then there, it's a lesson to them that, bro, these people aren't really effing with me. If you're somebody where it's not, you that know, you know, not example, I can't, I can't he's, he's in his, uh, he is one of, he is a legend in this whole Nigerian music thing. Talking about, but I think it's his own choice. I think it's his own choice in his terms own of, choice of what? as in like he's doing what he's doing. Like as in, it might be limitations and stuff, but like 
if he wanted to if he wanted to if he had the funds to do something it's I'm not sure about he's, like, he's, he's just not really that popular anymore he's just not popular also he has his run yeah he's not that popular he has run it's over yeah I know there's not amount of social no, media but, there's not amount of no, talk no, 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 there's not amount of tiktok but it's also if he does think like with people like um Debange Maybe Ice Prince. Um, Ice Prince? He shouldn't even, even be in any of these <laughs> conversations. <laughs> um, what's, what's that babe's husband's name? The bold guy? Um, um, Banky Banky w. w. Yeah. Do you think like they are maybe like, I don't want to say the older generation who would be buying tickets, but like they would be like, if Banky W said that he was going on tour, I don't know about you, I'm not really rushing. No one's checking to do No, but you know he, didn't have, he didn't have that big of an impact. To be able to come back and tell me that he's going on tour. Tour to do what? Okay, maybe, maybe, a tour, tour. A maybe it's a book tour no, or, or, or a movie premiere. Maybe okay, that. Okay. Not a tour. Tour, definitely not a tour. But like maybe like just a concert, like London concert or something. Like even no, me, I was, was, no, He doesn't even have a music yeah, catalog. Some to I, even, would you be my lover? Some okay, people, once that song is over, what next, what's the next song we're singing? Yeah. Are we singing? Are we trying to say it? Are we people? Right? People, we're not even trying to say it. Some people have to be consistent though. But whether the consistency lands, that's another story. Yeah, no, but what? There's some people that have been putting out tracks. Absolutely. Up on but track. you know, they, they but exactly, but you know that they, they know that they have I think she means consistently good. Like, yeah, but then also, and what, okay, <laughs> I know we've been speaking on this for long, but I think what I was just trying to say is that I just think we need to be, understand that one, there's a lot of factors that contribute to why things work. Like, sometimes things just work and things don't work. But I feel like if someone knows that this is where, if I said I want to be a singer, right? Mm hmm. And, I'm, and I've got this long run. You're obviously gonna do naturally. You're gonna do what you can to sustain it. Yeah. That's what every. That's the natural thing. And then suddenly, some next minute, it just won't work. And then you, but you can see a failed attempt. You, you know how you have an example of this was a failed album. Like you tried to, you tried to do. <laughs> oh, this was a failed something. You tried to do this and you didn't, and it didn't succeed. Yeah. Rather than someone being like off the scene or someone just not exhausting all the options that they have available to them, which is what I'm trying to say that if. You've seen, okay, you know what? Like, he's tried this, he's tried this, he's tried all the options that he didn't have previously, and it's not slapping them. Boy, your run is over. Mm -hmm. But for someone that, you know, let's say, for example, someone that you know that, I, I don't even know what us to pick, but like, you know that in, in concerts and stuff, this, his concerts are just a vibe. But then he doesn't really put our music and stuff, but then it's like, you know that we fuck with you when you're in concerts, but you haven't even done mm -hmm. a concert. You're not even actually doing what it is that attracts us to you. When they go. It's because because when Wendy Cole had his concert, he hadn't put out an album. Like, and, and yeah, when was that? Because he was just putting out singles. He was just putting out singles. And it was yeah, and again, and again, again. We all put, we all... I don't think that song was No, it wasn't, it wasn't out then. But we, um... All went to the Which concert was, exactly because we knew that the guy it would be a vibe. We like his music, yeah. Like, and because we haven't seen him in concert, this was in his a, first headline show. Yeah, so stuff like that contributes to it my point is that some people just have their right oh absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, like absolutely. there's no like for someone like, I do feel like someone like Narimali. Narimali. if Narimali was to say that he's coming to london now yeah people buy the tickets absolutely people depends would. what it depends what no no, no i know like, people would buy the tickets but this is especially what I'm trying to that went to the okay. last one Yes, but this is what i'm trying to say so if Narimali said that he was having a concert would you guys buy tickets i would consider it I would I'm moving my I ain't like getting away myself. Yeah, but I would consider it. Well, you know, the thing, when you're you you you're leaving Malta early to go to Burnham, no. you're not doing that for Naira. Of course not. Absolutely not. So I'm saying, I know. I would go, but I'm not even. And if it was sixty-five pounds, best believe I'm not. I'm not Absolutely not. But what I'm trying thing. to say that for Naira, no. his music is great. But I also know that. When it comes to concert, when it comes to that, he's gonna give us. You know, you just know someone in person is just gonna give us something. If yeah. you ain't doing that, I can, I can still basically. I know that obviously Whiskers release new stuff, but when I go to Whiskers, I don't actually go for the I stuff that he's releasing now. Trust me, I go for all the stuff that's going before. So what I'm yeah. trying to say is that you can trust actually keep on, you can actually keep on reeling stuff from before if people know that you're going to a concert and actually you've got friends in the and industry. You know that your really your really guests are gonna them. be your guests are gonna be lit. Yeah. People are gonna keep on gonna f with you. you don't have we're not talking about you have to do all the biggest stadiums in the world. And also, I think high. just lastly, I think cost also plays oh, yeah, a major absolutely. role in that. Like somebody, like for example, now if Wendy Cole, even me as well, I mean, I would buy the ticket, but I don't think anybody would come with me to the concert. <laughs> <laughs> if 
oh, Wano Cole now said he's going O2 Bricks now. He's charging £65 for tickets. Uh, it's just me and Tammy from my group chat. Yeah, let's be honest. Like, do you get what I'm trying to say? But if he said that he's putting out content, he's doing £20, like, Everyone will be like, yeah, I'll go because yeah. you're going and you're going. And I said that it'll be fun. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So I feel like mm-hmm. that stuff also plays. But then also, you have to think, like Tammy said, these things are not cheap. It's expensive. Yeah. You have to rent out the venue, visa alone. Yeah. That one as well. Visa for all of your people that are coming to Absolutely. you. Your stage manager. Yeah. You're this, you're that. Like, it's not, it's not cheap. It's so not, I get it. It's but... self funded. Yeah. But it's sad though. I actually really liked. Um, Naira when he had his run. But also, I just like his sound. Like, as in, I just like his yeah, sound. Yeah, yeah. He's wavy. Really... Like, and. I feel like this is how you also know that he's so wavy. He like opened the song for like Wizkids, the wild yeah, song, yeah, and like it was strong. Like everyone was like Naira killed it. When yeah. I was seeing like people commenting about the song and stuff, everyone was like Naira's verse was solid. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Even though there are two other people on the mm. who, on the song who are, I was even gonna say arguably bigger. Not yeah. even there's yeah. no argument. They are bigger. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, facts. but yeah, I agree. I like his sound a lot. Yeah. But anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed that <laughs> uh, debate. I don't know how long we kept in. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that. That's the end of the episode. I don't know how long we kept in. Um, my song of the week is Wow by. Oh wait, I just realized the song of the week. My song of the week is Wow by Wizkid <laughs> featuring Naira Marley and Skepta. Anyway, just like going back to the whole social media thing, like. Mm. <laughs> When I tell you TikTok, Twitter, Instagram, one of those platforms, they're just the gift that get, keeps on giving, yeah, because. I don't know if anybody's watched Love is Blind. If you don't, really quickly, it's a show where like strangers go on, they split the girls and the boys. Then you basically meet your potential or your future husband and wife, but you don't see them. So you only speak to them through a wall, basically. And um, it's meant to it's meant to promote like falling in love um, emotionally before you like the physical mm, or whatever, mm. etc. Anyway, then you propose again, you ain't seen the person, then you have a reveal where your fiancé and fiancé, and then, like, four weeks later, you walk down the aisle, and then you get to the aisle, and then they're like, if you say, I like, do you want to marry this person? I do, I do not. Some people will be saying, I do not. The other person said, I do. Mm. Yeah, anyway. But that's so, I do not, then that means it's already cancelled. Yeah, exactly, yeah. it's cancelled. Um, but in this particular case... Um, oh, Spoiler alert, if you're still watching it, yeah. go and watch another one of our episodes because I'm about to just tell you everything that's happened so that we can discuss this. But basically, there was a Nigerian Yoruba man on there. Sorry, I have to say the tribe. Um, his name is... <laughs> bless you. Thanks. His name is SK or Sekiru. Uh, and he was dating or he was engaged to a lady called Raven and she was just... She's American, mm. an American woman. Um, and was he like Nigerian? Nigerian, did he have an accent? Yeah, Nigerian, Nigerian had an accent, but was living in the America, so forming uh, America. Mm. Anyway, um, <laughs> mm. so they fell in love, or whatever. And even in the beginning, I was a little bit like, hmm, I don't really know if this babe is really because, like I said, which right, babe, the girl, the girl, because, like I said, right, you've fallen in love. I don't want to say enough because they have actually fallen in love like without seeing the person but then you go on like a honeymoon kind of pre-wedding like mm. everyone goes on holiday and that is like the first time you're really seeing the person apart from the reveal mm. but seeing the person spending time with them sharing a room all that kind of mm. stuff she was just giving a bit standoffish like oh I don't know I'm like really struggling kind mm. of thing blah 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 but anyway long story short they ended up actually like working it out and stuff and um working out like then they got married as in working it out as in like she started to fall in love with his physical and stuff like that okay vice versa right anyway so it comes to the wedding day she's like compromised a lot because um he's muslim so she obviously like wore turban on her wedding day but then also like she's not muslim no she's not muslim um and then like you know how like nigerians are like imagine she went to the gele uh, shop to go and get gele or whatever and the woman was like yeah so you have to make sure that even when you're going away you have to make sure there's rice at home make sure there's soup at home they're saying all this stuff right and they're like oh yeah like even though your husband even if you're making more than your husband you need to like lesser yourself like so that you're like that's the stuff they were saying on the show that's like rubbish. and i was just like oh my gosh they're giving us such a bad rap right yeah. now but anyway that's not reality and we know that uh-huh. we, we know that for sure especially not in our generation mm. anyway anyway so gets to the altar now she said i think she's already replied and said she does and as in i do Mm. and then he is just staring at her and like she even said in the reunion as well like it was like five minutes like it felt like five minutes where he the guy was Mm. not saying anything and he said i do not and so they didn't end up getting married but then we fast forward now to the reunion and 
they're actually still dating like they're still in a relationship mm -hmm. and stuff and like they're like hi baby hi baby yeah, yeah, right, 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 blah 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 so everyone's like oh yeah like really really rooting for these guys blah 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 bear in mind there was another guy on the show who like disgraced his wife and this woman was like I just can't believe you did that. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, mm. she was there, like, stand, like, mm. shunning that other guy because he did something wrong. No, and behold, who was who was shunning the girl? The girl Raven, Raven. Mm. was like, yeah, like you just treated her so so bad that like, you did this. Not knowing, like, what's next not knowing next door, next door. Hey, directly in front of you. That man that you're saying hello, baby, to is actually disgracing you. Anyway, so came out recently on tiktok was it tiktok or was it twitter i don't even know whether yeah i think it was, it. It was it tiktok yeah one of her friends or something basically like shared concrete evidence and literally walked through the relationship that he had had prior to getting oh, on was one of her friends. friends i think one of the girls one of the not raven i think it was one of the girl of the i think it was her herself it was her herself Oh, so the, yeah. that went through the yeah that put on the tic, put on TikTok that I watched that TikTok yeah, okay. where she, she basically exposed that they'd been having like a full blown relationship, relationship the whole time. The whole time. Yeah. He even was like, oh, what's who's this girl that's saying she's engaged to you? And she was just like, oh yeah, he I'll, was just like, yeah, yeah, I'll swear it out or something or like, oh, oh, it's for the show, show. Um, stuff like that. And like, they broke up anyway. And he basically said on his Instagram. Dear Love is Blind family, Raven and I left the Love is Blind altar as single individuals who went back to dating other people. I'm so sorry. That reunion. Mm. You not. No, no, no. Because this is how they gaslight you. I'm Don't be you. gaslighting them. Hmm. It's not good to be on fire. <laughs> <laughs> because the way he actually made it sound in this thing is like, yeah, we had an agreement that we were going to date other people. But in that reunion, and the reunion happens months later, because obviously this show, show is filmed, I think even like last year yeah. or so. And the reunion is like more recent. Um, and yeah, like he was basically saying like, yeah, we could date other people and that's like your business and they're, and they're taking legal action. We're going to read his actual statement. Dear Love is Blind family, Raven and I left the Love is Blind altar as single individuals who went back to dating other people. While our journey back together hasn't been straightforward, the unique emotional connection we developed from this exp experiment kept us together as friends and helped rekindle our relationships after the fact. Then he had another post, which I didn't screenshot because mm. this was on his story, where he was like, they're seeking legal action at the moment, so can't talk about it. Legal action like, what? I'm like... He legal said that on the party he's involved. I'm like, what? You're gonna go and tell the babe that you were dicking down that? Oh, actually, like you should you you signed an agreement to not tell anybody mm. about our affair. Mm. Like, I don't. Really, <laughs> she he's suing her for character defamation. Please, yeah, boy. That's the thing. Like, I was gonna even say because I've only watched season one. Mm. Yeah, I, I, think I know about this. Season you know, one, Laura, but I just couldn't. Laura, I just couldn't get into it because I just felt like the whole thing was just fake. Oh, really? I didn't mind season one. I thought season one was okay. Um, because but, by episode three, they're already saying I'm in love with you. I'm thinking, yeah, please, episode no. three, so episode one. And I'm just like, but the thing is, the less people know, the only thing back to uni times, the way people be feeling so it's not even just uni, but it's, it's like, like obviously because there's so much that happens after that, and the bit that's actually really entertaining is like when people are in their couples, and then you see the other people that you've dated, right? But then you maybe have rejected, so then people are like. Oh damn! I rejected her, but she actually looks banging. Yeah. Like these are the bits that are interesting. So they speed up the pods. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. it's which, not which one I day. It's I know, like, I know, I know. But I just feel like ah, I don't know how you can be talking to a wall. I find that difficult. I just I I can't I can't like for me I'm someone that <laughs> yeah personality is a really big thing for me. But sorry, I need to see mm. you. yeah mm. I need to eye you. Mm. I, I think some people. Were but the thing is that. Is it is it that okay? I know it is very different. It, the, it I'm not what I'm gonna say is very mad, but like is is it? You know when people like fall in love with someone that they like met online. Met online. Yeah. Yes, you have a display picture. And um, let's say like let's say for example like you guys aren't FaceTiming. Like yeah, that ain't running with me, boy. If you're not like, FaceTiming, if, if if someone if I've met someone online, yeah, yeah, and we've been talking and then we decide that oh yeah, let's meet up and stuff. I would have FaceTimed you before yeah. I've made that conscious step <laughs> to go anywhere with like yeah. I like you have like there's no Neve and Max <laughs> taught us well on but, okay, I guess, you okay, have okay, to okay, FaceTime. Okay, but are you FaceTiming because you're 
you're saying that I cannot get, I cannot feel until I FaceTime, or are you using the FaceTime to confirm that you're allowed, your feelings allowed. are just, no, <laughs> like, your feelings are like justified. No, 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 no. For, me, for me, for me, if I'm getting to know someone, before yeah. I've even dis dis discovered yeah. that I've liked you, we have we we hundred percent have FaceTime. You don't have an iPhone? There's WhatsApp call. Mm. You don't have WhatsApp call? There's Skype. Mm. Like there's so many. Like, mm. I have to like for me to. For, one thing about it's me, I'm a, I'm a I'm a I'm I'm a FaceTime babe. Like yeah. I'm that's that's my bag. Like yeah. if most people that know me, they won't they don't call. Like yeah. if you want to speak to me, most people know that you if we talk on a regular me. basis, then you will FaceTime me. Yeah. Oh, it's like a quick call. That's my bag. So if we ain't doing that, sorry, yeah. there's no. There's, there's no, yeah. we're not going, there's no I thing. am the same, but like kind of different. Like I couldn't just chat to somebody that I don't know and like, or I don't, <laughs> I've not met them first. Like that's why like these whole dating sites and stuff don't work for me. Cause I need to like, I need to know you first before I can even, otherwise I just can't build anything. There's nothing there. Like I will never like feel anything if I've not met you. Are you sure that that's what it is or that's, or you're holding back? Like, that's I am trust me. That's what I'm trying. That's, you, what, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, because a lot of the things we're talking about is because we is that a requirement seen, for you, or that's just you naturally? That's a requirement I think that's for you. Me naturally. What do you mean? As in, I I just can't. I don't know like I'm she's saying. basically saying that I could be talking to you for six months and I still and you could be the exact same. Or, or, or obviously, this isn't this can't happen. But like you could be the exact same as somebody I've met, like the same qualities, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But the person I met is all. I'm always gonna feel something more for that person because, because, more, because it's more real. I don't know about re reality or not, Shad. I'm just telling you what. Yeah, it because is. but I'm just thinking like. But my thing is like I'm. I know that I have a hundred percent trained myself because I've said. I don't want to, because I, you know when you, this is the thing. That's what I'm you know saying, you, you've trained this yourself, is what so you're natural. This is what I'm trying that's to say. That's what I'm saying, I, have you trained yourself? No, that's oh. what I'm saying, mine is natural, I ain't done no training. Think, I don't think no, it's a natural thing. Course, I'm not saying I don't think that's, that's natural. natural. But I just think. But I don't, that, I don't think that's natural. If you're talking to someone, yeah. every day, for six months, you're FaceTiming them every day. Oh, I'm not talking about FaceTime, sorry. No, but what, no, but. But what I'm saying is I think FaceTime would probably be different. That's what I'm saying, but my point is that, I can't even, for me, I cannot even meet up go with on any journey. No, it's not meet up with someone. I cannot go on any type of journey, any life journey with you. Yeah. If you, if you're not doing that, if I said, oh, let's FaceTime. Like, sometimes how I do it is like, there's never any time that I'll come on FaceTime just like randomly. Like, mm. obviously it's a buildable thing. Mm. But I'll just be like, oh, let's, like, like, oh, let's FaceTime. Or mm. I'll be the one to make a suggestion. Or if they make a suggestion, that's even better for me. Mm. But there's no way but that that's I'm going I'm on saying, the journey with exactly. you and without... Exactly. And at what point are you like... Sorry, I actually can't mm. you go. No, no, I was just going to say though, but isn't that more like also like a safety precaution? Like, why am I even going to allow me to even be speaking to somebody? Yeah, like, 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 but, but, but that's exactly what I mean. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But, but it's, not, it's not about me training myself that, oh... The, but for me, it's just... That's just a requirement. Like, a, exactly, but it's a requirement. <laughs> but, okay, but why? Okay, but what, what, what I'm trying to get to the root of is the fact that it's a requirement based on what? Is based it, on, I need to know if you're a real person. This is my thing. I need to this know. Is what, this is, is what I'm trying to say. You're, you're a real person. You're a real person, or you're not lying about who you are. This is what Me I'm trying to and say. Max us but this well. is what I'm trying to say that it's a safeguarding. It's a it's a lesson learned because we know that there are people out there who catfish. We know that there are people out there who aren't who they say they are. So I can't lie to you. Before I meet up with you, I need to know that one. I'm not gonna put myself in a dangerous situation because that's how people even find themselves in a situation where they've gone out somewhere and they, they're meeting a 50 year old man who's walking them away. That's what I'm trying to say. Do you know? But this is what I'm trying to say. Because of society, we now are more cautious about certain. Well, we try to be more cautious about certain yes, things because we've heard stories. Yeah. So naturally, I'm. You're saying it's natural, but it's natural because society has shown me that you cannot be falling for certain people. Um, and I take it on board. You can. Be, you can't be falling for certain people without seeing them, without doing this because of a safety precaution. So I'm not going to allow myself to do that. In my case, the physical attraction. But is, it is important. It plays a huge absolutely. role in me finding you overall attractive. Yeah, absolutely. So like the, yeah. the talking and the texting, that's all good and that. Yeah. But I need to, and pictures but just aren't Sharon, for me. Let me give an example. Let's say you are on a, on a social media dating site, right? And you're like, 
not social media, but like let's say like even a dating app, and someone's like messaging you, right? Before you meet up, isn't your mind like? And let's say you're, you're enjoying, you're actually enjoying the conversation. Like just yeah. generally, you're just enjoying the conversation. But naturally, aren't you even just gonna be like, bro, like? I also need to. Yes, I need to see you because of the physical. But yeah, most yeah, importantly, but most importantly, I need to know that you're legit because <laughs> because in a, in a, in a social is, in, in a in a uh, you know what I mean. I just think that I just think that regard, I think any that's any that's what I'm saying, that, that is a requirement. That's that's what I'm that's what I'm I don't know, but I feel like that's different though because that's a complete no 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 no. no but that's what I'm trying to say. Like, in terms of no, just but generally, then, just me just texting somebody without having any sort of into any sort of like confirmation that the person is real let's say now you've got the confirmation that the person is legit as in like you oh how can i explain it you've seen them you just know that they're a legit person like you're, you're comfortable knowing that the person that you're texting is legit do you think and you're saying that okay the physical is like so important to you and stuff but what i'm trying to say is that you're going to be more allowing of your of yourself to develop a feeling it might it can it can hit a it can hit a point That's where it's like cool, yeah. you know that it can't go beyond this until sure, i see yeah. you but you, you can cannot, allow you can't me that. to you naturally can't, you progress have any feelings so you like lost the train no 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 what she's saying is that <laughs> you know what do you know what happened to me yeah. i'm still trying to understand what she said before so then she keeps talking i'm like wait sorry i'm still back oh here. my god no what no, she's no, saying okay, what she, no what she's saying is Correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah. What she's saying is that when you're talking to someone and yes. you're texting someone and you've not met them and you've not met them, but you have the confirmation that they are a real person, person. That it's not like you've passed the safety. You, yeah. you, you guys the haven't FaceTime. You haven't. Face you guys time. haven't. You don't send pictures, know. but you know the so you know, person. You know this person is, a, and they are who they say they are. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because let's say, for example, you know, no, 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 as in, like, you know, you know, because somebody has said, no, because you know, no, 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 on instagram okay. yeah. maybe they're maybe they like i don't know maybe yeah, they pop up maybe you have mutuals or maybe they pop up a story or maybe you've they've gone on instagram live i don't know yeah. you just confirm that they're like you just know that they're uh that they're a real person okay. but you've just been texting back and forth yeah she's now saying that correct me if i'm wrong yeah she's saying that there's no way that you can be Talking with that person every day, you're even enjoying the conversation. That like, you're even finding out, like yeah. you know, like yeah, you've got you like, similar yeah. similarities, yeah. Part, like things like that. You cannot tell me that. You cannot tell me that. No, naturally, naturally, naturally you will no. not have any sort of like ah, oh, like connection, connection with that person. If you're yeah. talking for a long we, period we, of time, and we understand that they can all, they all. If we're talking it. for a long period of time, then I'm pissed that you haven't actually. Yeah, but also, I'm not trying to say that. No, but we understand that. We understand that there will be a ceiling. Because you're saying that physical is so important for you. But you're basically saying, like, you cannot even develop anything. Yeah, you're saying, what? No, I'm genuinely, what? I, that's how I feel. No, but what that's I'm trying to feel, say but, is but, that... But, but, the reason not, what we're trying to say is that... It's not natural. It's not a constant physical in terms of, like, the way that you might be perceiving it. Like, you obviously you want to be a physical way. You're in person. You can okay, see how you're vibing. Actually, but what I'm trying to say I is... I not explained myself. It's my, it's my problem. I haven't explained myself properly. It's not just... Okay, physical, yes, as in, like, you look good. But I think also physical and like the way that you touch you yeah so that i know that like in like we share the same space but that's like, what that, i'm trying to say yeah, that yeah but, but i'm but saying that's, that's a gradual thing, that's a, that's that's a gradual that's thing. Yeah. My, my thing is you cannot tell me that you, you cannot have, have some sort of attachment in, to that person. a bit of a bit of Sharon. emotional feeling towards that person Are you Sharon. About yeah <laughs> A few moments later. Yes. Okay. So wait, 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 wait. <laughs> what I'm trying to say is that you can still be like. I'm trying to say you have like a, you have a reference point. Like you know that this person is cool, but it's not like you know physically how you vibe because you just said now that you need to be able to touch. You when you were doing that, you're not touch. You're not touching him in the way that you were touching him now. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So what I'm trying to, what I'm trying to say is that it's possible to have. Uh, natural feelings just generally 
natural feelings just develop an attachment connect but you know in the back of your mind that actually there's always going to be a ceiling okay, up until but i think okay okay i think maybe again like i said i don't think maybe i'm articulating myself properly i feel like if i know you're real i know you we have mutuals i've seen you in person like not necessarily like we but, okay, but, okay, but the type of being in person because let's say let, okay, let, let me just say, let's say that you don't, you haven't seen them in person, but you've seen like an, maybe you've seen them you tagged. Can't use him no, as an no, you can, because what I'm just trying to say is that you know this person's legit. Yeah. Yeah. But physically, because you just said now, the physical for you isn't just like, you know, you're good looking, but it's also, I need to be able to touch, I need to be able to touch you to I need see to be how able you are. To test to see, our connection yeah, in, in person. person. But my thing is, yeah. even without testing in person connection, no. Imagine you just know roughly, oh, actually, like, Let's say I just know face wise that you're cool, right? But <laughs> everyone can be cool. But when you come to them, when you're actually next to them and stuff, like you know, I'm like, but physically, okay, you okay, guys okay. are working. I which think is why I, I can said, allow myself. I can. I get what you. I get what you're saying. saying. Uh huh. I can allow myself to get there. Yeah. Like if I know they're legit because I know them. I've seen them in yeah. person before. I'm not saying that in it has person. to be. Why does that be in person? I just said not person. <laughs> Wait, yeah, wait, 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 because Let's... I need to know they're legit. No, but no, I'm saying that you know they're legit. Can I just finish? Me... Can I just finish? I know I'm wrong. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know I'm wrong, but let me just finish yeah. what I'm trying to say. In, in, that, in a situation where, like, I know you're legit because I've seen you. I don't even know you like that yet, yeah. but I, I know that you're at least a real person. Yeah. 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 And I can verify you somehow. Yeah. Maybe we don't have close mutuals, but... I can find a way somehow yeah, yeah. yeah then i can the threshold for me like developing some sort of feelings obviously increases because like i don't have to be so guarded uh, yeah, yeah okay. exactly okay so, so, it's not, so, so you don't you don't you don't actually you need, need to see them like you said exactly. like you said yeah, but you said that you said yeah, you, you said 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 you I said naturally is because I didn't think until you guys have just described all this stuff. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> no, until, until you guys had started saying it like yeah. this, I didn't know that that was. Yeah, that's what I, I didn't know that that was something that I was doing to stuff. myself. Yeah. No, but I'm not even saying that you're the. Uh, yeah. I, whether you're I just doing it to yourself or not. Yeah. I'm just, just saying that. Period. I'm just saying that generally, like. Point blank. Mm. There's no way that, because of my own experiences, there's no way that I can ever say that someone <laughs> can not meet someone and not mm. have a connection with them. Because there's plenty of stories. Like I watched one TikTok of people that maybe they're living in America, but they're living in a completely different states. Mm. Maybe they've been talking to each other for like seven months. Like things get in the way, you can't get there, stuff mm. like that. But yeah, I'm just I would like, struggle. It'll take yeah, of course you'd struggle. Of course you'd struggle. Yeah, but. If something but is real, is, and if something, if you're gonna have a connection with has, someone, yeah. then I feel like anything is for me. Any, I'm, I'm yeah. like I live in like a fairy tale, like oh, yeah. people. But I generally think that but my anything thing is, is like, you even allow yourself to even get to a point where you're talking so consistently that you're. Like, I'm saying I don't even get there. No, but you're. That's because you're purposely. Because you're, you're purposely. purposely that's, that's, the thing, that's the thing. I don't feel like I am now listening to what you guys are saying maybe that is what i'm doing but like like i'm just yeah. not interested no but what i'm yeah, saying is that that's how like i see like, like you're i'm just no, not but we just but if say, you're we walking just into it if you're walking into a situation and you're like you know open-minded what, open like not even not even like open-minded but you're just like i'm just gonna be like vulnerable i'm just gonna let my yeah, feelings open -minded. yeah not necessarily open my well i guess so but what i'm saying is that you're just gonna be like i'm just gonna let myself Mm. not go but like i'm just gonna allow, just gonna allow just myself gonna to be let, yeah just let let it be what it be mm. sometimes those are the times where you find that those are the best kind of connections and you mm. have a much stronger mm. connection than someone that you met on the road that say hey babe you look <laughs> nice <laughs> or oh oh my friend my friend said that he wants to talk which is what i mean which is what i'm saying that it's about, the content, it's about the quality of the conversation you're having you're saying that yeah you're you're you don't feel anything but i'm i'm saying Imagine a situation where you're just talking to somebody, right? Like I said, you know the person's legit. You know they're real. <coughs> you know that pre. You've seen them like maybe like one image, but never you've never been around them physically in person. You don't know whether they're chained now, whatever. But you yeah. know that 
yeah they exist you know that somebody knows somebody or something yeah, like that yeah, yeah let's say you're just having a conversation right i don't know somehow they slide into your message or whatever it is yeah. and you guys are vibe imagine you're actually vibing like, imagine they come on something they say something like you're just like rah like let's say it's even just even music for example like mm. something that you're just posting out they're like oh did you know that and they and then they share you something and you're like oh let me show you this and actually you're like, actually you're, you're spending a lot of time just generally yeah. just talking about something you know what something's interesting yeah. and then you, you cannot tell yeah. me that like, you're like, actually hold on this guy's kind of like he's getting me like he's actually getting me and i just think that's natural and i'm telling you some speaking from experience sometimes those are like the best kind yeah, the of the starts of stuff the absolutely start, those things are like the best thing because it's kind of like I don't know how to explain that. You're not. F- I don't, it's not. It's. I don't know. It's. It's just organic. Like it's yeah. nothing. I don't know how to explain. Well, obviously, it. Like, like you can meet the person in, in person and still have that vibe. But I'm just trying I'm to say that. that I feel like sometimes yeah. the connection is even stronger because yeah. you're making a conscious effort. Like oh, like I have to reply or oh, I have to make sure I put time to to make sure that I, I think call it's this just person. I've just never done that. But I probably could. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah. 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 I Maybe think I could. <laughs> 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 but honestly but even regardless i feel like just generally just to wrap up um with social media and just like this whole falling wait hold on how did we even get here because <laughs> love love is like, oh love is blind falling with love yeah is like i just think mm-hmm. that obviously what has in the wall you know <laughs> love is like, obviously i think it's like we just discussed and debated now i think it's definitely possible to develop feelings with somebody that you haven't like physically met because i think if you have a good connection if you have a good conversation and then that's the that is ultimately the foundation of like a relationship yes people can say licks are super important but I don't see most people sustain with somebody that they can't even converse with, period, at all. Mm-hmm. If they, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. well, if they don't, like, I agree with you. But just to, just to, I guess, also add into the wrap up, the people who did not succeed on Love Is Blind, the reason why they didn't weren't able to get to that level because physically that they didn't because physically they weren't absolutely to one another. So yeah. I think it's a it's a case by case basis. Yeah, it's a case by case basis, but it didn't stop. What I'm trying to say is that I didn't, it didn't say stop that them it didn't stop them from developing the it feelings in the first place. From exactly, from to be just getting that forever. Forever. Absolutely, it doesn't mean that. And obviously, like, what we're trying to say as well is that. The physical part is important for that to work so that it, the actual relationship can flourish. But naturally, I feel like we do find ourselves in situations where we develop feelings for someone and then you have to naturally just put a bit of like a, a bit of a like caution, like as in like applied wisdom to know you're that, okay, be, that be a bit guarded. You're a bit, you're a bit guarded and just a common sense situation where it's like, I need to just wait until, you know, to know that this is a hundred percent. Like for example, I, I wouldn't typically expect someone, and maybe there are people out there to like accept a proposal or like actually as in obviously that's a situation where like it's actually a show yeah that's the point of the show but naturally i feel like and that's the whole reason why they have to even do the physical part they don't just say i do based on no yeah because any relationship has to manage you have to have both parts that work right but what i'm trying to say is that i do think that you know the it's possible to develop feelings for somebody without having that physical part but then obviously you just when that part comes into play, then it can d- determine whether it's going to work or whether it's not. Mm-hmm. But, um, yeah, I just think that, yeah, with the whole social media and that, that experiment, <laughs> I don't even know whether the show is going to continue now because obviously season one, season one, I, I don't even, I didn't even watch season two. I don't even know who was in season two. Season I so. one, I don't even know how many couples are that are still going. I think like, all the couples that are married are still married. Are they still married? Mm-hmm. I feel like there was a scandal though that happened. No, that's yeah. season two, I think. Was oh, like, it season two? two. Okay. Well, I'll be interested to know this. Anyway, anyway, Aisha said, I can't lie. If I was not getting being successful in real life, as in people are seeing me and knowing me and they don't like me, and then I go to a show and then they can't even see me, but they're still uh they're still denying me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, my stuff's on just down my here. load. Yeah, and yeah, they can't air that boy. Because yeah. really and truly, why was it like one of the black women? Like, I think she was the only black woman on the show. She really? wasn't chosen. Really? You can't even see her. I'm not saying that, like, other white people weren't yeah. chosen. I think there were other, like, there were other girls too, but there was one black woman <coughs> on the show, and she didn't get I didn't see a single date of hers, boy. Yeah. Maybe it just wasn't interesting. Maybe her personality, I don't know. Yeah. But it's just funny, isn't it? Mm, it very <laughs> is, boy. But, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. As always, make sure to follow us on our socials. That's BTS Pod underscore on Twitter on Instagram and also on TikTok. Again, make sure if you're watching on YouTube to subscribe, like the video. If you guys are a Spotify listener and you want to actually watch the visuals, head over to our YouTube channel. That's BTS Podcast and listen and watch us as well. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this one and we'll see you guys in our next one. Bye. Bye.